I would say this is a pretty um, com you know, complex scene uh, exam, basically due to the extent of loss of the building. 75 rooms gone. Now a pile of rubble. Terrifying video posted by guests on social media revealed the swift intensity of Saturday's fire and now sparking debate about whether smoke alarms were sounding. Chief Priest from North Conway Fire indicated that when he arrived, he heard the alarms and they, they stopped a short time later. Um, we anticipate that was due to the damage from the, the amount of fire that was going on. And pressing questions about the lack of sprinkler systems in that part of the hotel. That's in our state statute. Um, allows a, a non-high-rise existing hotel to not to have a sprinkler system. While we would advocate for you know, owners to consider sprinklers as part of capital programs and such, it's not a requirement under our state law. Marshal Sean Toomey says the fire started on the south side of the south end of the building. And if it started on an outdoor balcony, the smoke and heat would not be intense enough to set off an in-room smoke detector. We, we do know from... Uh, you know, follow up in the existing building uh, you know, of the, the fire area. There were smoke alarms like we would find in our own homes that are hardwired with battery backup that um, were working in the those would only sound in the individual rooms. The state fire marshal tells us it will be very difficult to determine the actual cause of this fire because so much of the evidence is destroyed. In North Conway, Amy Cavino, WMUR News 9.